In this DaVinci Resolve tutorial I will show you how to speed up or slow down all or parts of a video clip. I've assumed you have a basic understanding of editing in Resolve. A link to my beginners tutorial is included in the description below for those that don't. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. Okay, well I've gone ahead and brought this clip into the timeline and I've edited it. So I've chopped the end and the beginning off. Um, so, the first thing, if you just want to speed up or slow down a single clip with no changes, the easiest way is in Cut, just select the clip, right click, and then select Change Speed. And this brings the speed control up. So if I wanted to set change the speed of this clip to, I don't know, let's go four times. I can either drag this up. In fact, let's take it up even faster. Take it up to about seven. And in fact, let's type in manually. You can type in a figure as well. So I'm going to go eight times the speed. I've turned the volume off because um, these are quite loud, these clips. But this will also change the audio. So let's just play this clip now. So that's changed the speed to eight times. You can reset here by left clicking speed, this little reset button here, and it'll go back to the normal speed. Now, if for it, I won't play this one back slow speed, but if I wanted to slow the speed down by half, I can either drag this to the left to 0.5 or just type in point five and that will change the speed to half speed but this train will stay in the distance for ages so I won't bother going all the way to the end okay I'm gonna go back and hit reset so that basically is changing the speed of the whole clip now if I want to change the speed in different areas or different positions there are a few options I'm gonna go through the easiest option come down to edit select this I'm going to do two changes you can put in as many of the markers which I'll show you in a minute um, along any clip but just for ease and speed on this tutorial I'm just gonna change the speed I don't know somewhere about here in fact even further away than that this is quite a long clip because I want to make sure I got the train coming into the station. So we'll go to say there. About there. Okay. So to change the speed in different places, what you need to do is make sure the clip's selected and then right click on the clip and you're looking for something called re time control and this will bring up your time control and options so next to where it says 100% there's a very small arrow select this and then select add speed point what this will do is place a kind of marker now you can place as many of these as you want and change the speed between them as many times as you want um, in Resolve. I'm just going to do one point just to show you how it works otherwise this tutorial will just drag on. So the first thing if you place your point on the bottom of the marker hold your left mouse button down you can change the position of the marker so I'm going to come back to I'll come back to there that'll do I think we're all right there I know the ca camera wobbles a bit at one point so I'll just move it to about here say okay now the next thing you can change the speed two ways you can change the speed 
So if I wanted to just change the speed at the beginning, say, I can either select the little black arrow, and then I've got options here of change speed. And I could say select any speed here over 100% will speed it up, or any percent under 100% will slow it down. So I'm going to change this to 800%. Now if I go to the beginning, what should happen is the train will zoom in to this point and then go to normal speed. So that's one way of doing it. I could, if I wanted to, also change the speed by placing my mouse on the top of the marker and holding my left mouse button down and then move it. So effectively, I can either speed it up or slow it down. So let's go a thousand times. There probably is a point where this won't work, but we'll go back to the beginning and see if this works. And there you go and that's basically all there is to it this one here I could change the speed again by selecting the little arrow and changing the speed but if I wanted to manually change this I would then I would have to go ahead and put another marker at the end I won't do that it gets very fiddly working at the end I would probably have to put it about here to be able to move it but the more markers you put in, the more different changes you can um, effectively do. Um, like I said, I've got the audio muted right now. Um, so you can't hear the audio, but it also changes the speed of the audio. And obviously, if you wanted to mute the audio, you just use this audio slider here and just bring it down to zero. Um, and that's basically all there is to it um, you just go ahead and render your video now like I said at the beginning I won't be going into any great detail um, because I've assumed you've already got some knowledge of um, editing in Resolve so hopefully that's helped someone thank you for watching cheers